Hey guys, welcome back to Fishing Outside the Box. I'm just out here pond fishing at a little local pond and I want to show y'all my little secret fall bait. This is the uh, Berkeley Spy 70 Slow Sink. And I don't know if you can tell, but this thing has been chewed. I've fished it for several years in a row now. And uh, <clears throat> everybody knows that in the fall, what a bass do? They chase bait and, uh, and these little ponds around my area they chase these little minnows about like this and uh, these little propellers put off this sound that's uh, the fish just can't resist but the secret about this little bait guys shh, is it falls like a senko you it kind of comes in straight and the little uh, blade spin but when you let it fall it it shimmies on the fall and uh I've caught a few bass already. I'll put y'all on my head so you can see. And hopefully we can get into some bigger ones and some more. But uh, this is my secret little fall tactic. So pick you up one of these Berkeley Spy 70s in the slow sink. Um, there's actually some other good colors as well too. And catch you some fall fish. So stay tuned. All right. So these bass, I think they're they're gathering into like little wolf packs and pushing these little minnows up on the shore. So what I'm doing is I'm being real erratic with this. Oh, there's one swiped at it right there. Let's see if I can get them. Oh, there's a whole school of them after it. I'm being real erratic with this and kind of popping it and then letting it do that shimmy on the sink and that's what's just driving them crazy. They think it's a little injured bait fish. Got it. <laughs> oh yeah, a little bit bigger, but still tiny. There's another one. There's one, a little better, feels like. No, he's just wacky rigged. Another one, tiny fish. Good grief. There we go. Pond is left unattended. There's another one instantly. There's another one. Good grief. Is that the one I just caught? <laughs> Throwing this bait on a little 70 size bait caster. I think I have, I think this is 12 pound fluorocarbon. And this is a little, uh, let's see, 6.6 six medium. It's like a little jerk bait rod. Uh, and it's perfect. It's kind of like my little creek fishing setup But it's perfect for this little spy bait because it's pretty light There's a better one in that mud line there Sitting in that mud That's bad one that's the best one of the day wind has kind of kicked up a little mud line in this pocket and there's another one all right there's some fish stacked up in this little corner that one jumped off but it's okay because he was the same size as the lure there's another one little better one. Oh, there's one. <laughs> that one popped slack all the way into my reel or popped whatever that took the slack out of my line. Heard it in my gears. 
There's one. A little bit better. Okay, finish it off with a big one. This is like a, finally caught like a one pounder. Maybe a tad over. But I just got a call from my dad. He needs some help on a job he's on, so I gotta split, but. There you go, there's some tips on getting on a little fall bite when they're chasing little bait fish. Throw that spy bait and uh, catching more fish in the fall. Thanks for watching Fishing Outside the Box. Subscribe for more tips and fishing content, and we'll see you next time.